First, we have to understand concentration techniques. It separates parasites from fecal debris and increases the chances of detecting parasitic organism when these are in the small numbers. They are divided into flotation technique and sedimentation technique. Flotation techniques use solutions which have higher specific gravity than the organism to be floated so that organism rise to the top and debris sink to the bottom. Sedimentation technique used solution of lower specific gravity than the parasitic organism thus concentrating the latter in the sediment. They are easier to perform and it is the formalin ethyl acetate technique. Let's learn one by one. First is flotation technique. Take 4 gram of stool in 10 ml of 10% formalin. Mix it and let it stand for 30 minutes. Strain it through a wet gauze piece and add 0.85% NaCl. Centrifuge it for 10 minutes, decant and repeat. Now decant and add zinc sulfate to fill the tube. Centrifuge for 1 minute. After centrifugation, two layer will separate. Without moving the tube from centrifuge, take 2 to 3 drops from the surface film and put it on the slide and observe wet mount and iodine preparation under microscope. Now let's learn the sedimentation technique. Take 4 gram of stool in conical tube and add 10 ml of saline. Mix it well and let it stand. The next step is strain it through a wet gauze piece. Then centrifuge it for 10 minutes and decant. After decant add 10 ml saline and centrifuge again and rip it. And decant and after add 10 ml of 10% formalin. Mix well and let it stand for 5 minutes. After 5 minutes add 2 ml ethyl acetate. Centrifuge for 10 minutes. After centrifugation, 4 layer should be developed. Decant top 3 layer and observe wet mount and iodine preparation from sediment. The uppermost layer is ethyl acetate, then the layer of debris, then the layer of formalin and in last the layer of sediment formation occurs.